The city of New Holstein says it wants to redevelop a vacant manufacturing site, but the process could be a very slow one. Fox 11's Kelly Schlicht is here tonight with more. And Kelly, what is the city's next step? Michelle, the New Holstein Community Development Authority says it and the city will conduct a study to see what should go in that area. It's best known as the old Tecumseh Products Plant. The 400,000 square foot space has sat empty since Hoist Manufacturing closed its doors in 2009. But some around town tell me they're skeptical of whether manufacturing can make a comeback. The impact of the shutdown of Tecumseh Products and later Hoist Manufacturing spilled off this property and onto Main Street in New Holstein slowing business at the Village Inn. A lot of people coming from Tecumseh would stop and fill up and stop for something to eat as well. And the, that and lunch hours from Tecumseh were very busy. Second shift on Fridays was crazy here years ago. Not so much anymore. The city says it will conduct a $30,000 feasibility study to redevelop the area. Alderman Bob Bozma says the Wisconsin Economic Development Corporation has given the city a $7,500 grant to help. Basically, we're, we're, we started with empty pockets. Uh, the city has also come forward with money, $15,000 towards the study, and the New Halsey Economic Development Corporation also donated $7,500 towards, uh, towards the study. The city wants to purchase the property from Hoist Acquisitions. The company bought the property from Tecumseh Products in 2007. The city says this property is still zoned heavy industrial, but it's unclear at this point if a manufacturer will once again come back to New Holstein. I mean, I'd like to see another manufacturer that employs 2,500 people, but realistically, we're not, we're not holding out for that unless somebody is uh, comes along and and is willing to do it. As far as a manufacturing resurgence, business owners say they have their doubts. I really don't think there ever will be. That, that building has been added on to over the years so many different times. It's kind of a hodgepodge. And I know there's a lot of uh, cleanup that had to go on. New Holstein officials say Tecumseh Products would be responsible for any further contamination cleanup. The city could, could host public input meetings on what should be done with the property as soon as next month. Tom?